Hello everybody and welcome back. So today is a viewer request question thingy and it's how to mod Stardew Valley. So what I do and how I do it is I do it through, uh, oh actually let me just open up my browser. And don't judge me with everything, the, the clutter, the futter cluck over here just because this is like what I imagine most YouTuber stuff being. Nothing really inappropriate, just some games I play and whatnot. Anyways, anyways, besides the point. So what I do is I go Nexus. So I go Stardew Valley Mods, plain and simple. Scroll down until I find Nexus, boom. Now one thing you're gonna need, which you can get through Nexus, is Vortex. So you'll Google Vortex, and I'll try to link everything down below, but no promises. And then after you get all of that downloaded, you'll start up Vortex, and you know, it has everything you need right here. So, two things you're going to need is Sampy and Stardew Valley. Uh, usually, uh, whenever you click on something, let's see, let's go with... I don't even know what to do, man. Let's go new this week. See what they got. Anything special? Strawberry Dress Penny. There we go. We'll take this. Excuse my slow loading. And then, let's see. We'll go to Files. We can... Uh, if you already have Vortex, you just Mod Manager download. Just click there. Usually it'll tell you that you'll need Sampy for it. And you just follow the link to it. I'll also link it down below. Uh, to run Sampy, you literally just click on it. Okay, see, right there. Started downloading in Vortex. So to run Sampy, all you do is once it pops up, which will be the blue chicken right there. No, that's wrong. That's the editor. Uh, so you'll download it. It'll pop up down here. You just click run and let it do its thing. And then you'll be able to open Stardew Valley normal like this. And it'll pop up this window right here. And that's just Sampy running through and all that stuff. Make sure everything's set and everything. So anyways, once you get the mods, downloaded you will go vortex go mods and it shows all of these disabled which is funny because these are all the ones I got so here's a here's the one I never installed so what I'll do is I'll click it uh, where's it at right click open file manager I never use uh, vortex to install the mods because it never works so what we're going to do next is we're going to go, oh, we're going to open our Stardew Valley folder and we're going to have a folder called mods. And how you get to this is pretty simple. You just, uh, you open up your Steam or wherever you got it from. Steam's easier. You just right click, properties, local files, browse local files. And it takes you right there. So once you get all that up, you're going to want to go into your mods, take the folder that you want drop it in there. That's it. Plain and simple. Now, with Sampy, one thing you're going to need to do, especially with Steam, is, let me get it pulled back up. You're going to pull up the properties again. So right click, properties, general, and uh, set launch options. And you get this command right here, which is the modding one. And you just slap that in there, which I think it's just this part right here. That way Sampy can run as a launch option. But anyways, once you get that in, minimize everything and just double check, because Sampy will run through and check all the mods and everything. All right, so now we got to find Penny just to double check to see if the mod installation worked. That's literally all it is. You just, yep, there she is. She's in a special summer dress. That's all the mods for. So there we go, we got the special dress. All right, let me close windows. Sampy kind of looks, as you saw down there, it's kind of like a little weird puffer fish chicken, I guess you'd call it. But yeah, that's basically how you do it. I will link everything down below on how to do how to get there. And with uh, Nexus, what's really cool about it is once you pick the game you want, and everything, which is, you know, like I said, you just Google Stardew Valley Mods, scroll down, find Nexus. 
you can just click here and search for what you want like that and different trackers which I was looking for tractor but I'm dumb right now and don't know how to spell it but yeah he can search for any mod that you want uh, yes there are NSFW mods on here so that's something to be on the lookout for other than that it's really simple if you mess anything up along the way and the mods aren't working or Sampy's not working you can always go to the Sampy website and it will give you all the instructions on how to do it and it's really simple to follow through and if you have any questions just ask them down below other than that I thank you all for watching and make sure to subscribe it really helps out the channel and like I said any questions ask them down below I will answer basically anything for you thank you